With about two weeks to go until January 1st and recreational pot sales rolling out across the state, the Black Hawk is voting today on an ordinance that would delay recreational sales until July 1st in the city of Chicago. The caucus's concern is a lack of opportunity for minorities to benefit from the lucrative recreational sales. And we have four dispensaries in and around the Chicagoland area. Jeremy Unruh is the director of public and regulatory affairs uh, for Pharmacan. Right now, the company does not operate within the city. I think that really hurts the existing 11 dispensaries in the city of Chicago because they're the ones that will be barred from actually operating these adult use dispensaries in the city. There is no minority ownership in the 11 dispensaries who will be in business day one. This did surprise us. This was not anticipated. Over the phone, Pam Altoff caught off guard by the move by the Black Caucus. She heads up the Cannabis Business Association for the state. We have the city of Chicago making, it, making an attempt to stop um, an, an industry, a new program, a new opportunity before it has the opportunity to move forward and, and to be tested and yeah. to be rolled out. An unhappy Mayor Lori Lightfoot says delaying sales will have negative unintended consequences and take money from social equity funds and programs intended on helping minorities gain entry into the business. A six-month delay could mean a $5 million loss for the city.